Good morning, y'all. I'm in my kitchen to start. Um, I'm making tacos. Also, I lost my roof piercing today at Berry's, so I had to go to the place, whatever, and get a new one. And, of course, the one that I picked out, like the, my starting one, that I was like, oh, I really like that one. It was $600 because it was like real diamonds and real gold. And I was like, okay. I was like, do we have something a little cheaper because that is not in the budget. So then we got this one and it was 50 bucks. So it does its job. It is a little sore, but I think that's just because it fell out. And then I had to like put something new in it. Um, and she also told me to blow dry it to dry it out. So, I don't know. I really liked the place. I will be going back. It was Sheeman Modifications. I don't know. It's somewhere in Dallas. Um, yeah. It was really nice. The girl was really nice. It's just they have really high quality jewelry and that's why it has a high price tag. Like, if it was in the budget, I would 100% pay $600 for an earring. It's just not in my, I started working six weeks ago budget. It hasn't even been six weeks, it's been like a month. And this is going to make two meals, and that is it. And then also have maybe turkey sausage and or chicken sausage and rice and have that for Tuesday or Monday and Sunday and Monday. Put cheese on this. Oops. Oh my god. This is oh my lord. Someone take a fork away from me for real. for Thanksgiving, so. Yeah. And I think when I'm at her house, because I don't go to the gym, because I don't have a gym membership out there, obviously, because I don't live there, I think I'm going to go on some runs. That's my goal. I want to go on at least, because I'm going to be there for Tuesday, Wednesday, Thursday, Friday, at least. I'm hoping to go on two runs in four days. Because honestly, sometimes I forget to work out when I'm at with her. So, yeah, but here is my earring in better. Hopefully you can see that. Uh, this way, is that better? I'm like trying to use this mirror to show what you guys can see, yeah. But yeah, love to say it. I think it's not really great, I'll be honest, but. Michigan State is playing Indiana, and we're up right now, 24-21, and Indiana's trying to tie right now with the field goal, so. Let's see, ladies and gents. Oh, I'm gonna do this. I'm gonna film it with my camera this way, and then I'll, and then I'll combine them so you can watch with me. Oh, 
Oh, they didn't do a field goal attempt. I said that they were going for a 45. I'm lost. Air ball to literally no one. We exhausted. I just slept like crap though, so. so the blitz got home quickly. It looked to me like there was just a miscommunication between Swordsby and Williams. Let's see what Jeffrey Stravinsky has for us. So as we talk at the time now about it, if they're going to throw this flag for an intentional grounding, which I think that's maybe questionable if that's where they're going. But if they are going to flag this for intentional grounding, this timeout that Indiana has remaining is what can save them from the touchdown. Yeah. Not the intentional grounding. No, it literally was in BFE. Fourth game of the season. Also, our new QB. He's giving me like uh, the the brother from Zoe One Hundred One vibes. What was his name? Oh, there's a flag. Bruh. QB, don't be a fucking, don't be stupid. He literally ran on the field. What a ding dong. Who is that? And that's a W for the M S U. I think that S was backwards. Yeah. M S U. Yay, we win the fourth game of the season, thank god, because we literally suck so bad. Hello, y'all. <clears throat> I filmed... Ow! Also, my ear hurts real bad. I think it's just swollen. She looks red. She looks mighty red. But you're on a tripod because I filmed two videos today so I love that I'm also just like at the stage where I just like we'll do a sit down of it video and I just like
don't even put makeup on anymore because I'm like, well, whatever. Oh, the F1 race is also at midnight tonight. So. I'll make a decision to let y'all know. Okay, ladies and germs. Hey y'all, I just took a Barry's class. It was hard, it was really hard, but it was good. Sydney's the best, I love that girl. Um, but yeah, challenge is officially done, thank God. But yeah, I need to go home, start laundry, study clean you know the normal Sunday reset and then get after it for the week and you like plan what I want to do but yeah it's almost Thanksgiving which is crazy like where has this month gone it's insane Okay, hey y'all. I just put a hair mask in my hair. Oh frick, my laptop's gonna die, hold on. Okay, I just threw a hair mask in my hair and now I'm gonna, because I had a body shower, because I needed to get the sweat off my body because I will break out like a horrible if I don't. So, <clears throat> I have to clean. So I'm gonna start with making my bed and then we're gonna move on to the kitchen and then I'm gonna come back to the bedroom. But. Big ass leg, a boy with really big legs. Chef's kiss. 
They're so, uh, pretty sure he has a girlfriend though, so that's really disappointing, but yeah. I would move to San Francisco for that man. I'm not even gonna lie. I've never even been to California, but I'd do it for him. <laughs> oh, ladies and gents, I'm sure I'm not having a good time. My head hurts really bad. Back one more game, back one more game.